Hi, nice to see you back at Garfield's Creation. Today, let's make this cucumber cake. While it's so easy to prepare, it's also delicious and healthy. And you can make it without an oven too. You will find the entire recipe in the description box below. So let's start. We will begin by grating a cucumber. This is a large gouty cucumber and preferably take the ones which has those yellow streaks on it. If you cannot find this, you can use the regular cucumber as well. These cucumbers you usually get during the monsoons. But you can make this cucumber cake any time of the year using the regular cucumbers too. So I just finished peeling off the cucumber and I'll just cut it into two pieces. This will help me in grating the cucumber. This cucumber has got big seeds in it, so I'll just slit it open and try to remove the larger seeds out. But if you're using the smaller cucumbers, you can use the seeds as well. I won't be removing the entire flesh, just the thick cucumber seeds. After I have removed the seeds, I will now grate this. For this cucumber cake recipe, along with the grated cucumber, We'll also be retaining and using the juices that come out. I've just finished grating the cucumber and you can see there's lots of water in it. To make this recipe we'll be just using one cup of this cucumber. You can use any measuring cup or a bowl to measure this. But make sure to use the same measuring cup for all the ingredients as well. So we'll be taking one cup of this cucumber and you can see I'm just taking the upper part of the cucumber and that little water that goes in it, we'll be using that as well. So I'm not taking the entire juices of this. I'm trying to take the upper flesh of it. So this is one full cup of grated cucumber. This cup is a 250 ml measuring cup. So I'll measure all the ingredients with this cup itself. So here you can see this is one cup of cucumber and the juices still keep coming out. That is one cup of lapsi or broken wheat, one cup of grated jaggery, three fourth cup of freshly grated coconut, half a teaspoon of elaichi or cardamom powder. Next I will be using half a teaspoon of salt and one tablespoon of ghee that is clarified butter. These were all the ingredients that we need. Now we'll start putting all into the bowl. First I'll just add the jaggery and mix it with the cucumber. I will just mix this a little bit. I have grated the jaggery fine so this will get melted faster. So after the jaggery I'll be using this lapsi. This is the finer quality of lapsi. It's also called as broken wheat. Next, I'll be adding grated coconut. Use fresh coconut for this recipe. It gives a nice flavor. And now all we have to do is just add the rest of the ingredients into it. That is the LIG powder, salt and the ghee. You can use any jaggery for this recipe. If you use a darker colored jaggery, the cake color will only be darker. That's it. So now once all the ingredients are gone into the bowl, all we have to do is just mix it well. This recipe is so healthy. As you can see, there is no maida, no sugar in it. And in place of the lapsi, you can also use the thick rava here. Once you mix this thoroughly, we need to keep this for at least one hour. So it gets enough time for the remaining jaggery to melt and the lapsi to absorb all the juices from it. We will now let that soak in for at least 60 to 90 minutes minimum. Now here after one hour, you can see most of the juices have dried up. That's because the lapsi has absorbed all the juices. The jaggery too is completely dissolved. So just give it a quick stir. Here I have taken a 6 inches round cake tin pan. And I have just used a butter paper dough. You can also use a baking paper and just grease it with some oil or butter. We'll just put in all the mixture into the cake pan. So if there is lots of juices left into the cake mixture, it will just take more time to bake. So 
So let this mixture soak in for at least minimum one hour or you can even keep it for a little more time till all the juices are absorbed. So after adding the batter into the cake pan, just level it well and then we'll just tap it a few times. I'm just pressing this a little so that there is no air bubbles left in between. We will be baking this cake over a gas stove. So let's see how to do that. I have preheated a large vessel for the last 10 minutes. And I have placed a ring stand inside it so to keep the cake pan on that. To bake this, if your vessel is not very thick, you can add some sand or some salt below. Just place the cake inside it and we will just let this bake on medium flame for around 25 to 30 minutes. So you can keep a watch on this after 20 to 25 minutes and check it in between two. This cake took me around 30 minutes to be baked well. I have switched off the gas but I'll still keep the lid on this for some at least 10 minutes. After 10 minutes I'll keep it on a cooling rack. And this is another cake that I have baked in the oven as well. In the oven it took me approximate 25 minutes. After getting it out from the vessel, I kept it on the cooling rack and placed a cloth over it and let it cool down completely. That way, the cake will not get dry and it will be nice and moist. And once the cake is cold, you can just run a knife all around it. Just place a plate over it and flip it over and tap it a few times to release it and to come out. So after your cake is baked, just keep it in the vessel itself or in the oven itself closed for at least 10 minutes Then keep it on the cooling rack and place a cloth over it and let it cool completely so with this the cucumber cake is ready all you have to do is just slice and serve this cake is not only just delicious but very moist and healthy as well i also have a cucumber cupcake recipe already on my channel too you can watch that as well if you like to add some nuts, you could add some cashew nuts while mixing the batter and then bake it. So a very healthy and delicious cucumber cake is ready. You can check out the texture of this cake. It's so nice and moist. Do try this recipe and I'm sure you're going to like it too. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to Garfin's Creation. I'll see you again. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.